This is a, a quote from David Allen, who's a, a specialist when it comes to productivity. And it's it, the, today's presentation is going to be revolved around how to limit feeling overwhelmed. And hit this quote here, um, the mind is for having ideas, not holding them, is all about uh, delegating tasks and uh, being organised with your task and having a system approach so you're not feeling overwhelmed. So for those that are studying, for those that have work, for those that are still in school, you're going to have things that distract you and um, and ultimately could affect your game day preparation from a mental point of view if you don't stay on top of them. So now's a good time in the off-season to, to practise some different things to ensure next season that the mental preparation and how you get um, stuff done each day is uh, in routine and it's not something you're creating it's something that you've practiced that system and you know it works for you and, it, and it's effective and and limits you feeling uh, distracted or stressed on on game day is the ultimate focus of today's presentation so this is david allen here uh, presenting uh, at a conference uh, he's an expert in this area of productivity he's got heaps of content out there uh, i'm a big fan of his work and um, he's got something that is um is, is really effective in terms of his process uh, and his system, which is capture, process and review. This is a three-step process uh, that he has implemented over the years uh, and he now teaches people to do it and it helps improve productivity and prevent feeling stressed and overwhelmed with tasks. Uh, so this is really, really important. It's also a way that you can transfer this into game day as well in recognising um, what's important in the game uh, and having a process that works for you, whether you're recognising that's something you can't control or is it something that you can control and then reviewing and reflecting it at quarter time, half time, three quarter time uh, with your peers. So it's something you can tr transfer into game day, but ultimately today is more just some tools that you can use to help limit stress so you're feeling uh, mentally fresh come game day. We'll go through those different processes now. Uh, so the first one being capturing. So for those that uh, have a notepad are in the habit of journaling things with their training diary, whether you use the inner game journal, uh, which I know I've published a bit about uh, and collaborate with Stefan Mork on our uh, Instagram. Uh, so you may be aware of that. Uh, or you just simply use a notepad like I do like this. From there, it, it's really important that you action those steps. So the next step with this one is writing down a calendar if that works for you like if you've got an iphone an apple uh, you've got a calendar this is an example of mine where I've, I've set different tasks that are relevant to me and my life so obviously the podcast is something i spend some time on social activities that might be a friend's birthday you don't want to forget that from there the third step is to make sure that you like talking about testing earlier we want to review and take the time, it might only be 45 minutes on a Friday um, or 30 minutes, you know, whatever time it takes to review your system and whether you're doing the important tasks that you need to do that week. Uh, 